Welcome back to today's project. It's a crisp, frosty morning at the farm. It's moving day for the Timberwolf firewood processor and conveyor. We've got a couple firewood deliveries on the schedule for today as well, so let's get after it. First task is to pull out the conveyor. The trailer tongue of the conveyor lives a hard life, as it's designed to sit on the ground under the grizzly bars of the processor. Bark and debris that fall through cover it up pretty quick, making it a pain to move by hand. No problem. Knuckle boom to the rescue. It sure makes short work of rolling the conveyor out and getting it onto the truck hitch. Lock it down and hook up the safety chains. No man handling needed. Lower the conveyor down for transport and secure it with a strap. The bumps in the road will actually walk the conveyor up if it's not strapped down. Too early in the day to be taking out power lines. Now that the conveyor is ready to go, let's get the processor folded up and ready for transport. The live deck on this model is raised and lowered with an electric winch. Simple and effective. Just plug in the controller. Unspool the cable. Feed the cable through the pulley on the live deck. Hook the cable back to the lift mast. And wind in the winch with the controller. I like to stop it just off the ground, making it easy to fold and stow the legs. It's duck season here. The folks over on the state game land are busy this morning. Thick layer of frost on everything this morning, so I'm walking extra careful. I busted my tail off camera. I hate you guys missed that. The red brace pins to the mast, holding the live deck in position for transport. I always tighten the winch cable down for good measure as well. Time to hit the road. The conveyor pulls pretty well down the road. We don't move it often. If we did, I'd definitely want to upgrade the tires and hubs. First delivery of the day is a face cord of seasoned oak. Let's get it loaded up with the knuckle boom. A quick reminder if you aren't already subscribed, please consider doing so. We have new videos every week with firewood, farm, and equipment content. 
We've also got a chainsaw giveaway coming up that you don't want to miss. Stay tuned for more info on that. All strapped down and ready to ride. Repeat customer, a couple of neighbors that split a face cord every year for backyard fire pits. Unloading half the bag here. No big deal, just chunk it out into a pile on the driveway and the customer will handle it from there. And back on the truck for the neighbor right down the road. Leave the rest of the bag with them and, and cross that one off the list. Yeah, I think so. The next delivery is a bag of campfire wood for a buddy of mine. It's in the opposite direction and had to route right back by the wood yard, so I didn't load it earlier. Hang a bag right from the knuckle boom and fill it by hand. My buddy has a beautiful spot here overlooking the pond. Perfect place for a fire pit. This camp firewood is super seasoned and ready to burn. Should make for a great time over the Thanksgiving holiday. Now back to the wood yard for the processor.
crank up the jacks, remove the chocks, hook up the hitch, and we're ready to roll. The Timberwolf Pro HD XL weighs in at around 9,500 pounds. No match for the F550, but you definitely know it's back there. Almost forgot the seat. It's been a productive day. Now to get this thing moved and set up to chomp through some new logs. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next project.